not it, is it? I mean, that's not great. I'm not gonna lie, when I left the house with the hat on, it looked pretty cool, and now I feel like I just look like a dad on a summer holiday. So basically, I'm at the beach just now and take myself on a little date. Um, I've had the whole day off, so I'm doing stuff I like to do. So I am taking my camera to the beach. I guess this is the start of my vlogs. My hat looks so stupid right now. I literally can't deal with it. I'm going to go on the beach, try out my new camera, test it out. Um, but it's the 2nd of April today and yeah, starting off with some self-love, myself. Okay, so I'm at the beach right now. I'm just taking some time for myself. I have a whole day off, so I thought I would just come here and just chill out for a bit, figure out how to work this new camera. Yeah, just basically I want to start vlogging because I'm just so happy right now. I'm just loving where I am in life right now. I'm very excited for it, and I'm also very blinded by the sun just got a lot of things to look forward to this year I want to document everything and even if nobody watches this I'm gonna look back on it myself it's such a beautiful day today it's about six or seven degrees I've got a massive jacket on at the beach because it is normally absolutely freezing and it's actually not that bad today the sea is really calm there is hardly any wind at all it's just so peaceful and beautiful so I think I'm probably gonna sit down for a bit and chill out, listen to some music or something. I can't get this to stand up again now. Um, nope, that's not going. Hello vlog. So it has been a while, oh this lighting though, it has been a while since I have last spoke to you. Um, I want to say a lot has happened. It was Katie and Darcy's birthday, so I ended up getting Darcy like a little jasmine dress up costume and I got my sister, well I sent her a card, um, like a personalised card and I sent one to Darcy as well. And I told her in the card that we could get matching tattoos when I go down to visit her, so that is very exciting. She liked that a lot, so that was good. I've got the Mac Murray Festival tomorrow, so the Venga boys are playing. And then there's other bands as well, but it's also one of my good friend's birthday, so I think we're going to go to the festival and then go to her house because she's having like a little garden party thing during the day. And then we'll go back to the festival um, at night for the Venk Boys. I think that's the plan. So, yeah, what am I going to do now? I did, however, have had a little spending spree. Oh my gosh, my hair! I didn't even tell you! Sorry, I keep getting distracted. I knew there was a massive thing I forgot to say. But, um, yeah, so that's changed. I honestly love it. I've wanted this hair for ages, but now I keep getting distracted. Is that I went on a bit of a shopping spree and I shopped at H&M, um, Shein, and I got some shoes from Steve Madden. Yeah, so they've came in and they've been waiting up on my like wardrobe thing for ages just waiting for me to show you so that's what I'm gonna do now enjoy okay so starting off with this little number I'm not gonna lie great so you can hardly see any of the jeans also please just ignore that my door handle fell off and I don't know how to put it back on. So this little top is from Shein. Um, most of my tops in this haul, I think, 
are from Shein because I just wanted some cute little spring tops um, that weren't very expensive um, and that I could just wear. I have honestly worn a top like this for ages though because I think it's like super flattering here. Um, and yeah, you can adjust the zips. It's just all good and I like how it's long sleeved as well. It's like um ribbed and it's it's very very see-through I don't know if you can tell I don't know what the lighting is doing but it's very very see-through so I am wearing something on underneath um but you can probably see that if it's mega see-through I just don't have my glasses on so I can't see a thing um but yeah so I like this and then I should have probably started with the jeans because honestly the jeans the jeans the jeans are probably one of my favourite pieces from everything that I've bought. Let me see if I can give you a closer look. So the answer to that closer look was not really, just a bit of a squinter angle. So um, yeah, this is, these are the jeans. So they have a little pattern on them. This is what the bottom do. So they're a bootleg and honestly, these jeans are called like 90s flare I think on H&M and they were $34.99 I think and I absolutely love them. I feel like I'm getting into the to the 90s early noughties vibe. I know that was last year's kind of thing but I'm doing it this year so that's fine. Um, but yeah I absolutely love it. It just makes me feel like really like you know really like snatched honestly okay now for this next top I probably wouldn't wear it with these jeans because it's a lot of pattern but I just didn't want to take off the jeans because other tops will go with them but this is like a little Hawaiian reminds me of like a Hawaiian kind of top Um, as I say I probably wouldn't wear it with the trousers but I think it is super cute Oh, it's so cute for like a summer or something. It's orange and um, like a light orange kind of peach with the cream on it. Someone is staring in my window. Okay, um, like get over it. I've got a camera. Don't look up here, you know. <laughs> but yeah, so I think it's so flattering. Hi. Okay, next one is this halter neck. So I probably should have said the last one was a halter neck as well, because it was. But this is a little halter neck top with a pink, well it's all pink, but with a nice little collar detail on there. It's got a really deep V. And maybe I would wear this together. Um, okay, so <clears throat> I have only tried on these all once and I didn't actually wear anything underneath when I was trying them. So I think this one is quite see-through. I still like it and I might not wear anything underneath it but I'm not sure yet. Um, Because as I say, I cannot see how see-through it is because, yeah, I can't see in the monitor. But this is the back. It's a very, oh, you can even see the label or is that my hair? Um, but there it is. It's a ribbed material again. We have a running theme here. It's a very pale yellow. So that probably explains why it's so see-through, but there's like a little knot detail there, so it kind of ties it all together. Thought it would be nice because it could show off my tattoo. Um, and yeah, just super beachy vibes. I absolutely love the colour of this top. So it is very cropped um, again, but it's the same kind of shape as the other ones. This one is ribbed as well, of course. Um, but it's a very pale green like a pastel green and I never wear green like I have literally no green in my wardrobe apart from one shirt that I can see right now Um, I just don't wear green that much but recently I've actually really loved it like I've just loved looking at the colour I love like an emerald green that's like my thing that I look at and I'm like damn I need you in my wardrobe but this isn't this is an emer emerald green this is a pastel green so I mean I think so anyway but I love the shape it gives me I don't have big a big situation here going on as you can probably tell 
but I do actually like deep V's because I just think they they look really nice, like they look really flattering on me. Um, and other people with maybe small chests. Um, but yeah, I like how there's the band that cinch cinches you in at the middle. Again, I don't know if I would wear something under this, like a bra under this or not. I'm not sure. Um, but I am just now. Um, but the back has a little crisscross, which is so cute. And I probably would wear these with these jeans. Um, I don't see, I don't see why not, you know. Um, but yeah. This is from Shein and these are from H&M. The trousers, can I just tell you? I was so like, will I get them, will I not, will I, will I not? And I'm so glad I did. Literally H&M jeans, I just think that they were made for me. Like their trousers just fit me so well. I've got like a, a couple of pairs of, of their trousers in my wardrobe and damn, they always just come through. They're so comfy. I think these are like a 10. Um, but the top is from Shein. I actually just wanted a little white tank because I've got a couple of trousers that have like designs and like I've got like tartan, tartan trousers, which sound really crazy, but um, I do. Um, or like checked and you need like a bit of a cam you know those trousers that you just need a bit of a cam or top so I just wanted um, one like this but this one is actually super super see-through um, I don't know if you can see it on the camera but when I looked in the mirror anyways it was but I don't know if that's because I didn't have anything on underneath but I have something on, on underneath today the jeans honey let me tell you about them so these are the jeans from like the waist they're green and white checks. Tell me if I'm wrong, but was this length not just absolutely made for me? Also, yeah, you may have noticed by this point, I wear odd socks and that's just the way it is and you're just gonna have to deal with it. I'm so sorry if you don't like it, but I just think I have more important things to do with my life than match socks, you know? But yeah, they are flared jeans at the bottom and I am so in love. They are so comfortable. I can do this with like, with no worries, just in case I ever need to do that, you know? You never know when you're gonna have to do that. Um, and then a cute little, I like the cute little gap it gives you. Oh, I just love it. Damn. I need like places to go to wear this, but you know when you love your clothes that you've just bought that you like wanna wear them all the time, but you're also like, I don't want them to get wrecked by going anywhere. <laughs> so I don't want them to go out, you know? And the other thing is that I was thinking of, I have no idea what jacket is gonna go with these that I have got in my wardrobe. Maybe like a denim shirt, but I literally have no clue what jacket would go. So I'm very open to suggestions. Okay, I know this isn't for this outfit. I mean, that kind of looks cute, not gonna lie though. Um, oh, why does that, no, maybe, I don't know. Um, but I did also get this little pink cropped shirt. It's like a corduroy shirt, I think it's called. Um, I think that's what it said on it. But how cute! It's the perfect crop. It's like the perfect size. And it's got a little collar on it. And what does this say at the bottom? Enjoy the little things. Mmm. That is so cute. But yeah, it's very comfy. The length is good. Like, I hate it when you straighten your arm and then it comes all the way up here. So, length is good. It's comfy. Wait, I can actually tell you how much this was because I kept the price on it. No, I didn't. But this is a small. So, excellent. Um, I have one more piece of... No. Two more... Pi no. Four more pieces of clothing to show you, but... I don't think any of them will go with what I'm about to show you. Maybe maybe one of them actually, now that I think about it. But I also got, because I was in the theme of the 90s, a shoulder bag. But wait, wait. You're not ready. Stop it. Stop it. Hi, can I have a coffee? Stop it. I think it's so cute. This is what the pattern looks like. Someone said, ooh, it's fake Gucci, but I'm like, it's H&M. It's literally not, like, 
it's not, I don't, is that what it's trying to be? Because I didn't know that when I bought it. But it's fluffy though. It's like, um, like a felt kind of material. And the strap, I just, I've honestly not looked inside yet. Okay, good. We've got some paper in there. <laughs> but this was, is it going to tell me? No, it's not. But I thought this was so cute. It's perfect size. And the hat has got a little silver butterfly on it here. <laughs> And I keep thinking maybe I should wear this to, not not this obviously, but the bag and the hat and other clothes obviously. Maybe wear that to the Venga Boys tomorrow just for the festival seasons, you know? <laughs> you know? I don't know. But I'm going to go pick the kids up. Um, <laughs> no, but I honestly love this combo. So keep a look out there. So I'm going to show you the other three items of clothing I've got, but this is one of them because I said I'd got four and it's honestly just, I just wanted like an oversized top um, to go to the gym in um, and you know do that thing where they tuck it up here and then you have your shorts and that so it's like long in the front, short in the back and also it's a very comfy, I can wear it with leggings, I can do whatever I like with it. But I also bought this hat. Um, from Shein. Just wanted like a nude hat to go to the gym in. I actually love hats at the minute so I thought this was super cool. It's just a little nude hat. I honestly didn't pay attention to what it says on it. Los Angeles vintage made but it's from Shein so who knows. I may as well just show you all my accessories that I've got while I'm wearing this white top because I don't think that the other couple of items will just, you know, look right with it. <laughs> I got a bandana last year but it just made me look like a pirate so I try, I'm try. i going to try this one. So I thought the colours in this one were so cute. I just don't know if I'm made for bandanas honestly. I think with the right with the right outfit. I don't know if I'm wearing it in the right place. Like, oh man, that was not a good move. I honestly don't know, so <sighs> we'll see. But I honestly, um, I actually got these. I keep looking in the monitor. I need to stop doing that. But I got these sunglasses as well. Oh, I can't swear on here. But these are just like Anastasia. Who? Like who phoned? Hi. Hi, who's there? Hi. Um, oh, vibe. <laughs> Not the bandana. But like this with maybe like gold earrings or something. I was like, you know, like in your car pull up. Hi. So I thought these were really funky. Um, but I honestly don't know if I'm just going to wear them for pictures. Because I don't know if they've got that special protection in them or not. I have no idea. Um, or if I'm going to wear them out or to drive or whatever. But they came in a cute little case. So I thought that was really sweet. Okay, so I also got these cute little cropped jumpers here. Just to go to the gym. This one says change is good. I also got a red one and it says choose to shine. It's quite like a brilliant red. Oh, it's quite a bright a brilliant red so it's a very bold and loud um, but yeah I just got these to just go to the gym in um, because sometimes I wear like a crop top and shorts and I just want like one side to be long um, and then if I get too hot then I can obviously take it off but yeah so cute I think one of these was in the sale so it was only like five pounds and I'm so sorry I keep cutting off my head and all this I just want you to get the full image of the clothing. So something else I forgot to tell you guys is that um, I just wanted to be a little bit more independent um, and my nail person has said that she isn't like doing nails and stuff anymore so I decided to do my own nails and they've came out, sorry for this little interruption, I swear I'll get onto it in a sec, but I tried to do like little cow prints and then I thought 
let's just do it the opposite on my other nails so they're honestly not that great but we're trying um but that does lead me on you probably saw it there to my rings so i got some cute little rings um just for summer vibes you know um these are like pink and red little um rings here with just different designs on them and then some little fruit rings and i just thought they were so sweet but i'm obviously not gonna wear them together um i wouldn't wear them like this but you know just as a little detail on your outfit you know or when you're driving you're like oh i've got cute rings on <laughs> um but yeah i thought they were really sweet they weren't that expensive either this year baby is all about accessories i'm just saying it is for me anyway my hair has gone so crazy with all the changes but right i'm not sure about this one because i think my tattoo like i got it because I loved it, obviously, but like the cut out is, oh, my hair. I just like basically wrecked my hair getting into this dress. So I've just shoved it up again. I have no idea how it looks. Um, but this is the dress that I got. So it's like the sleeves are a little bit flared and it's got this little ruched bit in the middle with a cut out section. And I wasn't sure how I felt about the cut out section because I got it to kind of show off my tattoo because I don't have a lot of um, dresses that do that but I feel I think that the patterns and the colours in this kind of clash with my tattoo a little bit um, but I love it anyway I'll probably still wear it out and I'll probably keep it but but yeah so it's just like a little short bodycon dress um, and I'm still wearing my fluffy socks so you know but yeah love the colors in it it's very like 60s 70s vibe it feels good it feels soft it's comfy so yeah and i'm pretty sure this is part of their new little um it was their like new in collection but i just saw it and i needed it so i just bought it yeah i'm just going to show you the last item i got and it is from steve madden and it's a pair of trainers and I think they're in the colour dusty pink or dusky pink. Look at them. I'll do them one at a time so you can see. But I have wanted these shoes for ages. Like I saw them ages ago and it was in lockdown I think. I didn't have too much money then so I didn't buy them. Um, but they've got the little Steve Madden logo on the front. And I honestly don't know what the kind of material this is called. Like, I honestly don't know what it's called. Um, but they're hard plastic kind of feeling on the bottom. I don't know what they're made of, though. Um, they do add a bit of height as well. So, I've done a haul for you today. I don't know if I'm going to put this in the main vlog or if I'm going to make this a video by itself. Because I think it actually took quite a while afterwards. So... If it made it to the full vlog, then that's amazing. I'll see you in the next clip. But if it didn't and it's just a video by itself, then welcome to my new YouTube, I guess. Um, that was really awkward, but I've wanted to do this for ages. Um, and I kept putting it off. I didn't know what to post and stuff, but I'm just now doing whatever makes me happy. So if you want to watch, that's fine. If you don't want to watch, then I really don't care. Like, they can click off if you want I don't care I'm doing this for me I'm doing it so that I can look back on it look at all the memories and whatever because this year is going to be absolutely fantastic so thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed and my hair has been kind of a hot mess throughout the whole thing but thank you so much and yeah so that was everything there and I will see you again soon